My name's Kirsten, this is my husband Steve. We've got two children. Our younger son, Fraser, um, was diagnosed approximately two years ago with four cavernomas in his cerebellum. When we first found out, uh, we panicked, we worried. Um, we were initially told we might have brain tumours and we had to go through a lot of tests and investigations um, and then eventually we were told there were cavernomas. Um, we found cavernoma alliance to be really helpful, really useful. Um, seems to be the only source of information out there for parents and patients um, that seem to be suffering with cavernomas. Um, our son on the whole is very well. Uh, we have good days and bad days, would you say? Yes. Um, but on the whole, he lives, you know, a nice, happy, healthy life. Um, we have a dilemma of whether to have the cavernomas removed. Um, we were told by a local neurosurgeon that he should have them removed. Um, and then we went for a second opinion in London, uh, and another neurosurgeon said to leave them until they caused a big problem for him. So at the moment, we're going along that line. We have regular... MRI scans every six to nine we've months. Those, we've cut those down, haven't we? They were initially every three months. Um, the neurosurgeon uh, in London, which gave the second opinion, said that we only needed to have them every, every year, which is right, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Um, and that's the route we're going down, down now. So it's just a case, really, of monitoring. Uh, we can, of course, go back in at any time if, if, he does, if his condition does deteriorate in any way.